hello friends good morning good afternoon good evening so this in this is an update about the you know the yesterday's meeting so there was a proposed meeting between kea which is the karnataka examination authority qpk which is karnataka unaided private engineering colleges which conducts comed k and the government right to discuss about the next course of action related with scheduling the counseling process for kct and comed k both right but that meeting could not happen because of the fact that there is a pil which has been filed in the court right and that's the reason kea and qpk both have to you know cancel that meeting and it will happen soon but uh, you know this update is about that pil right so karnataka high court right on monday september 12th right they have issued notices to all the three parties which is the karnataka state government karnataka examination authority ka and qpk which is the comet ki authority right to in a response to a public uh, interest litigation so th there is a group of students who have filed a public interest litigation on each which action you know karnataka high court has you know issued notices on which this three parties have to respond as soon as possible before that there is no meaning of having a common meeting and scheduling the counseling process so it is very important to understand that uh, what is that pil and how uh, you know it imp important it is for the students benefit right so if you see in that pil right that pil has pil has challenged the admission process given by comet k so you know there is an uh, admin process given by comet k and comet k has said that for admitting the students in the engineering courses under management quota seat if they leave the seat if they leave the comet k seat then they will have to pay five times of the tuition fee as a penalty which is too much if you leave the comet k fees you have to you have to pay five times equal to the tuition fee as a penalty if you surrender the seat in the first round of counseling which is quite unusual and not good right as per the students and it's not good as per the parents as well right that's why this pil was filed and that and the kea state government and comet k are supposed to uh, give a response to this pil and the petitioner of that uh, pil has claimed that the this penalty clauses mentioned in the fee refund policy actually deprive students of participating in the second round of counseling so this is the second part that such students cannot even participate in the second round uh, of counseling so this so this is one once if they surrender seat they have to pay five times and they cannot participate in the second round and it is cited under the pil that this type of decision is arbitrary and that way you know students full fees will be forfeited as well as they are supposed to pay five times of that fees right comet k fees right this type of thing is completely illegal and this is opposite of the guidelines which is given by aict aict and ugc for the all india basis right and that has been you know not followed in the case of uh, comet k and hence because of this pil you know comet k counseling cannot move further and unless this issue related with penalty of seat surrender is resolved right and the government uh, uh, gives a proper explanation and court accepts that or court forces government to withdraw such clauses then only counseling can move further right so that's a small update i wanted to give and counseling should happen only after the kct repeaters row is solved as well as this pil for comet k you know admission seats are solved